It is time for another loop. But before that, I wanted to talk about my friendship journals that I have made. Um, they're just three different books that have unique questions and they're made to help you build a deeper connection with your friend. And it can be anybody, your friend, um, your mom, or someone you're in a relationship with. Um, so they're in the description below if you think that would be something you'd be interested in or you know someone that would be interested in them. All right, so we are doing the ISTJ loop. Um, their function stack is introverted sensing, extroverted thinking, introverted feeling, and then extroverted intuition. So when the ISTJ is in their prime, they're utilizing their first two functions, introverted sensing and extroverted thinking. But when they go into their loop, they start to utilize both of their introverted functions, introverted sensing and introverted feeling. And initially, that's not a bad thing. But what can happen is that if any type is stuck in their loop for too long, they can become obsessive over certain things and it becomes increasingly more difficult to climb out of it. So I just want to go over what the obsession would look like and some ways that could help each type to climb out of their loop. So when the ISTJ is in their loop, they start obsessing over the past, but not just the past, but how they failed and they become increasingly harsh on themselves. They start ripping apart what they've done that has failed in a situation and then it makes them increasingly uncertain and fearful of the future. Instead of being motivated by the logic that they have gained through their experiences, they're now being motivated by what they feel and their inner moral code. They start wanting to only do what they absolutely know is going to work rather than being able to take any risks at all. They can start doubting themselves and their choices. And because of this, it makes it very difficult for them to plan goals because now they are uncertain of their own choices, their own capability, and then also the outcomes of the future. And then it just kind of keeps them in this uh, constant spiral. But also, they'll avoid um, social gatherings because it's just an increase of uncertainty. So like with every loop, we got to make sure that we address what is pushing us into the loop. But at the same time, we can do some things that can help us. So for the ISTJ, it would be really helpful for them to realign themselves with what they know is absolutely true and dependable rather than the past and how they feel about something. Then you start paying attention to the small details that they know that they can change. It can also be really helpful to research something that's interesting to them because it helps them to focus on the fact of a matter. So the facts of the different topics of research that they might find themselves drawn into. So I hope those are helpful. If you're an ISTJ, I'd love to hear your experiences in the comment section below, and especially just to be able to help other ISTJs that might be stuck in the loop themselves. And don't forget my friendship journals. There are three of them that have just different questions. Um, so if you did one with somebody, but you want to do another one with someone else, you can buy another one. And I hope there are a way to help you connect with the people around you. And I will see you guys in another video, another life. You never know. Bye.